You know, Carrie, and, and we mentioned at the outset, I just want to speak to this since I said I mentioned it in the intro that you do also um, separation agreements. Could you just touch briefly on what they are and, and how they're used? Sure. So the ultimate result from whether you go through mediation or collaborative is that you're going to ultimately have a contract, which is your separation agreement or your marital se settlement agreement. That is a contract between the parties that addresses all of the issues between the two of you. There are times when I may represent a person, a client in negotiating those terms with either, you know, between them themselves with each other and I'm preparing that document or where I'm working with the other party's um, spouse and negotiating those terms back and forth. It's just another process option, um, you know, that settlement negotiation that is available to clients. You know, Carrie, I'm, I, I was looking forward to this interview um, for a number of reasons, but I love the fact that your firm and, and what you're doing um, seems to be very progressive. You know, it's like a new way of doing things, you know, and, and a lot of times new, it, you know, people don't know what to make of it, but you're one of the few, and I told you this in show prep, you're one of the few people that I know that actually do collaborative law. I know a number of mediators, but in terms of uh, in, in collaborative law in that world, you're one of the few people um, in Maryland that I know that do this sort of work. So you're really at, uh, you know, at, at the forefront of what I believe, I think as people are exposed, as they're educated to new and different ways of coming to resolutions, um, I would guess that people are going to, you know, take a second look at, you know, collaborative law and go, hmm, you know, maybe this is this is the route. You know, I don't want to have indigestion every time I meet with my attorney <laughs> or the opposing uh, the, my 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 for soon to be ex spouse's uh, mm -hmm. uh, attorney. Um, so I I love what you're doing. Um, how can we? Mm -hmm support you um, on if you're on social media as I know you are how can we support you I'm going to put your contact information on the screen thank you um, so we are on social media um, Facebook Instagram YouTube TikTok, um, and our website uh, which you have listed so Jacobson family law on all of those and if are there um, resources that people can can use on your website if they want more information on what we've talked about today or on other topics? Yes. So we have lots of blog posts. Our YouTube channel has different videos about the, these topics. Um, and we often post, you know, five tips about different things that are going on on Instagram and Facebook. Awesome. Carrie, I want to thank you so much for, you know, just being gracious with your time and joining me today and celebrating our 50th um, episode. Uh, this is this is really special and I appreciate you for so many reasons and I wish you nothing but success um, in, in your practice. Thank you so much for joining thank me and you. I'll talk to you in a little while. All right. Thank you so much. Thanks. Everyone, Carrie Jacobson, uh, she was absolutely wonderful. Um, I, you know, I'm, was looking forward to this episode and, um, now you know why, because I really thrive in being in community with people who are doing things, who are, you know, changing the way that we look at things. Um, and I want to mention that if there is anything that we at Women Winning Wednesdays can do for this community, I want you to email us at info at elsawsmithlaw.com um, or post on any one of our you know, social media networks. Uh, we'll certainly answer more of your questions as, you know, as we go forward. I want to thank our viewers for making this such a fun and fulfilling experience so far. I want you to, I thank you for showing up each week and really inspiring me to show up for you each week. And I also wanna take a special moment to thank my team, Abigail, Allie, Lindsay, and everybody who has helped us to bring you content each week uh, for the past 50 episodes. I'm still in awe. Um, I have hope that you've learned that in order to really get ahead, you need a team. No one person can or should do it all. 
as an estate planning firm, we can be a critical part of the team that's going to help you gain peace of mind over your health and your wealth. We empower our clients by crafting comprehensive estate plans every day. We'd love to be on your team. If you are in Maryland or the District of Columbia and you need help with your estate plan, give us a call. Our number is uh, and information are at the bottom of the screen. And by the way, don't forget to subscribe and or follow us wherever you view this show on Facebook, LinkedIn, and YouTube. Go back and view some of the full episodes on our growing YouTube archive. I'm Elsa W. Smith, your Maryland estate planning attorney. Thanking you again for joining us on episode 50. Here's to 50 more. Be well. We'll talk to you soon.